waiting for the last goodbye that hasn't happened yet. I think probably um, I've learnt the most from hearing other people's experiences rather than asking them specific questions about who they know, who, you know, within the industry who helped them or whatever. Um, I think the more you can learn about how people have done it, because everyone's path is different, so um, somebody will not need the same contacts or connections that I had so those questions are almost um, kind of defunct really um, but if you can ask people their stories then you get a bigger overall picture of how things work and I think only when you understand how they work can you make healthy choices and decisions about how you want to go about being a musician because there's never been as many options as there are today. I think the variety of things that you offer is um, is fantastic and they're obviously tailor-made um, uh, to the people that that you get coming here and um, and it's nice to see that it's not all based on um, you know a, a, a kind of being a professional like having a career in music that it's not all about that one aim but it's about it's about so much more than that it's just for the enjoyment and just um, as a kind of healthy way of being then do it <laughs> yeah I mean obviously I'm completely biased because it's my job but um, if you've always wanted to play a guitar that's been sitting in the attic for 30 years or whatever then um, um, I don't know I just think music is such a great and powerful experience 